Hey guys, so I'm here at the Disney store and there is a line. I'm here to get the limited edition Beauty and the Beast, so hopefully I get them. Keep your fingers crossed for me. So it's a month later and I left work early. Actually, it was a half day, so it all worked out. I'm here to pick up my Beauty and the Beast limited edition dolls. And I'm back home with my three limited edition dolls. This is Gaston. I wasn't sure I was gonna get him, but since I actually ended up getting a number for him, I ended up buying him. I'm glad I did, but he looks great. He is one out of 2,500. And this is, of course, the main attraction, Belle. And I mean, she is stunning. She is amazing. This is like the snow scene in the movie. They actually made more of her. And so this is Belle, one out of 5,000. And then this beast right here, Again, such a freaking awesome figure. I mean, it's beautiful. And he is one out of 3,500. Let me take the plastic cover off so we could look at them a little more in detail. One of the things that I love about this doll is that you could actually take the plastic cover off and just look at them in detail. And look how amazing it looks. I mean, just the material and the detail that goes into these dolls is amazing. I really don't know what to say, it's so stunning. Look at Gaston's big hair, he has really, really big hair, which I kind of like what they did here with his hair. I mean, he comes with this this mirror right here, uh, which is, it looks like it's a real mirror. Um, so that's pretty awesome. And uh, I mean, everything about it, look at his boots are like really great and the material on his pants. And I mean, just this vest right here, all the embroidery and the jacket, and I mean, his tie. Like his face is just, the sculpt is amazing. And then you have Belle right here, again, a lot of embroidery. And I mean, I'm not sure if, I want to see if we can see her shoes, but I would have to unpin it and I don't want to do that right now. So we won't get to see her shoes, but look at all the details here. Her hair is like set perfectly. I mean, it's even like pinned down to her dress. Um, but it's really cool. She comes with this little bird. Um, and then let's go to Beast and the Beast. I mean, look at him. He's just humongous. His feet are so big in this cape. I mean, look at the detail on the cape all around. He comes with two little birds in his hands, which is like really adorable. He has this really cool uh, like uh, gem right here. And it's just so much material in his head. It's just... The sculpt is just unbelievable. There's another bird over here, actually. He comes with a lot of birds. Um, and he's just stunning, 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 stunning. So Beast, I got, I got number uh, 1,941. And then I also got Belle, 3,455. And then this is what I'm kind of excited because Gaston, I got 309. That's a pretty low number. I'm not sure if it matters, but you know, sometimes I always get excited when I get a low number for some reason. But yeah, this is my set, limited edition set. This is the first set that I actually pick up at the Disney store. I'm usually, I do have a few of them, not that many, but I did buy them on eBay. So this is the first one that I bought at the Disney store. As you can see, everything I went through to get them. I was lucky enough to get all three of them and I'm super excited. Now I have to find a spot for them. These boxes are humongous. Uh, they're 17 inches and I need to figure out what I'm gonna do with them. But let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you guys were able to get them. If you like Disney dolls, all types of dolls, action figures and toys in general, then you should follow me because I do review all that stuff. Thanks for watching Mars Toys.